Hey everybody, Jay here. Welcome back to the homestead here. We are out in the woods as always and today we are going to build a little, I don't know if you want to call it dock, a walking platform to get out onto our um, skating rink here. This this is an area of the homestead we discovered last winter. I'll attach a video or a link of me skating on it last year, but we're going to really expand this. We're going to grow this. This is going to be an area. I'm going to come down here with the family. We're going to do a fire pit. It's going to be a whole nice thing. It's on, it's on the list of things to do. We're going to rent an excavator next year to help do that. But anyways, today what we're going to do is, um, let me bring you closer and show you what's going on. All right. So the issue we have, and I, and I seen this last year is that the edges for some reason, I don't know if it's the flow, the edges here don't freeze too well. Right over there, you can tell how thick it is just by looking at it. It's super, super thick. So I think what I want to do is we're going to get some spare wood, some scraps. We're going to build a little like walking deck, dock, whatever you want to call it, so we can get out to where it's thick. Last year I cut with the chainsaw right about where I'm pointing here. It was eight inches thick, but it was still open water here. So we're gonna go back to the shed. We're gonna build some just type of walking platform with scrap wood, not really too overly concerned about engineering and just plop it in so we can uh, get out there. As you can see, it's trying to freeze up nice. Not today, today happens to be 40 degrees, but it is freezing up nice. All right, so we're back down here now in the uh, firewood lot here. We have a bunch of scrap construction lumber um, out here as you can see conveniently covered in snow so why don't I dig through save you guys that time lapse but why don't I dig through see what I can come up with and yeah um, we'll build something just to get us out there it only needs to be like 10 feet so maybe we can find some 2 by 10s all right we'll be back be back in a jiff so you know how they say one man's trash is another man's treasure well I found this the skid on the side of the road a while back and I grabbed it. You want to know why? Because I said, wow, those are some big 4x4s. I think this skid's probably about, I don't know, let's measure actually. Let's see here. This might be perfect. Wow, that's over 12 feet. That is perfect for what we need. Just over 12 feet. So let's drag it back to the shed. And... Okay, so I don't have any 2x10s in my supply. I have some 2x6s, so I think we're just going to cut a bunch of these to fit, and then that should work. We'll have a little bit of a gap in between, but... Most of the time, it's going to be just me walking on it, so I'm not too, too worried about it. So, um, this skid is heavy as it is, so I think we're just going to cut all these 2x6s to fit, and then we'll carry those out after the fact. We'll sink it into the, well, we're probably going to put some feet on it, but we'll sink it into the ground, and then we'll build it out there, because um, it's pretty heavy, and it's a little bit of a walk. So, yeah, let's go ahead and cut all these and then we'll be good to roll. All right, so I think this is kind of the idea. Again, this is just made from what I have kicking around. This isn't pressure treated. This isn't, you know, a legit dock, but it's just enough that we can walk across. It's decent, those gaps aren't too big. Not, none of this is screwed down, but again, just enough for us to get out onto the ice. That's all I really care about. So let's go ahead now and these boards aren't attached. Let's shave some of that weight off. Let's drag it down there and we're We'll go from there. This thing is not light. <laughs> All right, I gotta put you down. So I didn't bring my tripod with me because carrying the big skid was enough. So sorry about this weird angle. I got you hooked onto a tree, but let's see if that ice is, um, let's see if it's frozen enough where we can gently slide this out. I doubt it, but... That length looks pretty good. I might actually get away with creeping this lightly out there. Check that out. 
Sorry for the crummy angle, but you get the idea. This is kind of what kind of what we're going with. Do you think it can hold the weight? <laughs> wow. Oh. Here cracking. Uh I don't know if it can handle one more step. <laughs> We're gonna go safely back to shore. This is so cool, huh? Why don't we go get the rest of the boards, we'll screw them down, and then we'll go from there. All right, so we were able to get the, we dragged the wheelbarrow down here, so now we should be able to go ahead and work our way out. Yeah, what do you say? Sounds pretty good. about you but that, that's pretty cool enough space to walk on definitely here cracking we're like maybe two weeks away from it freezing enough where we can skate you can even see how thin it is there how much thicker it is out here so that's kind of the idea with this so I brought out two extra pieces let's see if we can slam those through whatever ice is there screw them to the side to help give this some extra just extra support I don't want it to sink and freeze like you see now. I kind of want it out of the water just a little bit. The, these back 4x4s are on dirt or soft ground, we should say. So we brought two more 2x4s. Let's see if we can sink them on the side and make something happen. I'm trying to get just an idea of how deep this goes. I got an idea actually. Why don't we go ahead and put this here. So that's about, water's up to there. So that's about six inches of water. I got an idea now. All right, so we got our two edges on. Now the question remains, since our ice broke, can we get it back out there again? So let's put you guys back on the tripod and see what we can come up with. That is sweet. All right, we gotta go because my feet are absolutely frozen. It's only been two minutes out of the water, but as you can see, that four by four, just out of the water, no big deal. Think that'll do all right. Yeah, as soon as this freezes up, we could just skate right out, off into the sunset. All right, so let me know what you guys think. Um, this is so cool. We're going to trim some branches. We're going to clean this area up. We're going to be working this area all winter. As soon as this completely freezes, we're going to cut all of that vegetation out and then we'll deal with how to um, dig the roots out later, another day. But anyways, my feet are freezing. I'm going to go inside now. <laughs> but yeah, I'm super happy with how that came out. I really hope we get some freezing weather coming up. It's 40 degrees today, but yeah, I'm happy with that. Let me know what you guys think. This is just for now. We're going to build something Obviously a lot stronger, more durable, maybe even a little bit farther out. Um, but for now, this will get us out there. Because as you can see, this is all open water. This never really freezes. So yeah, I know I'm rambling. Let me know what you guys think. Leave a comment. Appreciate you watching. And as I always say, we will see you out in the woods.